Hey guys, so I'm back with another video. This one is going to be a quick haul. I um, grabbed some things when I was at the Family Dollar today. Uh, I was so surprised to see that they actually had alcohol. So I was able to grab some of these, uh, the big $3 bottles. My mom, she needed it. Um, she's diabetic and she runs out of the little pads that they use. So we'll have this as a backup with some cotton balls. Um, like I said, $3 for those. I got six. And these came in the mail uh, from Walmart.com. Ladies, if you have ever experienced um, being sweaty, I can't stand being sweaty. As you know, we can't be wet in our below the belt <laughs> in our purse area. You, we can't. So these, I will suggest you try them. Um, they are the best panty liner I've ever used. I use the larger size. I'm a big girl. And these saved the day all summer for me. They really did. Um, so these packs cost $6.94 and as you can see there are 93 in each pack. I grabbed four of those. I grabbed some little off-brand soda from Family Dollar. These were $2.75 for the 12 packs. Um, and once again for my son as usual. Um, I grabbed the paper plates. These are my favorite. They don't melt quickly in the microwave. Uh, those are $3 a pack also. And um... That's 110 plates. Those last forever. I grabbed three packs of those. I also picked up this pack of washcloths. Um, oh, it's upside down. Sorry. Yeah, so I picked up this pack of washcloths. There are 20 in there. They were $5 at Family Dollar. I'll run those all through a wash cycle before I put them away. Um, you can use them for everything, so... I don't have to list those things. Um, I was glad to see this. I believe I saw this in Peggy and Don's haul. And I was like, wow, I never even tried that before. And I was happy to see that they had it. So I grabbed two of those. And um, I, I will put the price in the description box. I don't remember the price. And I left the receipt upstairs. Um, the water was $3 for a 24-pack also at Family Dollar. And you can never get enough of that. I use the spring water to drink and the distilled water to cook or purified water to cook. Um, I also grabbed more flour. This is on the way in the freezer. This was two seventy-five, five pounds. And I uh, grabbed some of the cup of noodles. Those are three, four dollar. Also at Family Dollar. I grabbed both brands. I don't. I haven't tried either one, but when the thing goes down, you know, I'll eat anything. And um, so I grabbed a couple of boxes of these crackers. I really like these. I accidentally grabbed these thinking I was getting the ones that I got from Dollar Tree recently that were so good. Um, and I grabbed some of these instant potato boxes, cheddar and bacon, cheesy scallop, just something to throw in the pantry. Of course, every time I go in Family Dollar, I grab more beans. Uh, they only have the Great Northerns and the Pintos. And I just found out that Pintos are the beans that they make refried beans out of. I was so excited to find out about that. Thank you to my subscriber that told me that. Um, I grabbed some dried fruit. Uh, these are really good. I like to take these on car trips. But these are going to be great for the bug out bag section of my pantry. And these. I'm a big kid at heart. Um, you should grab some of these for your kids. They're a dollar a pack. It's like three little party packs. If you are in a blackout you have some kids, and they can sit in the dark and, and pop rocks on their tongue or whatever. Whatever to amuse them, to make the time go faster. It's a lot of fun. I grabbed a couple of those. Who knows who might want them. Um, this is blurry. The big baking soda. Now, have you guys seen anything that big? That's four pounds of baking soda. <laughs> I was so surprised that I saw that. So I grabbed one of those. That was $3. I, I would probably get another one. Really big. I'm going to have to break it down and vacuum seal it in smaller uh you know, sections with the oxygen absorbers, but I was shocked to see that big, huge baking soda. Okay, so other than that, that's it for my family dollar haul. I have a Dollar Tree haul I'm going to attach to this. That way, um, I can just make it one video and you guys can see what's going on and we can keep it pushing, okay? Alrighty. Alright, this is also another little add-on I'll put on. I um, ran by the um, pawn shop today and grabbed a bag of ammo. These are ones that I, I'll use in the in the range. Um, hopefully I won't have to put several of them in a human, uh, but these are intended for the range. 
They were $39.99 for 50 And I also grabbed a box of the, um, of the hollow points. These will only be for self-defense. I will not be taking those to the range. Those were almost 50 bucks by themselves uh, for 20 bullets. So, uh, one more thing is this solar powered, uh, this solar powered, why can't I think of what to say? You guys can see what it is. It's a charger. Um, and you can charge several devices at one time. And it has different uh, access points for different devices. I don't know if I, I showed you guys this in the last video. Also, it has the flashlights, and they're really bright. Um, and the solar crank radios, you definitely need one of those. Everybody needs that. Very convenient. So, I'm sorry I'm breathing hard, but once again, running up and down the stairs. <laughs> All right, I'm throwing this in for my friend, my new uh, subscriber that was concerned that I didn't have any water. Um, this is a stack of water. I think this is one two three four five six okay that's six cases of water right there um and some bottles here i also have this same stack of water upstairs in my upstairs pantry because i don't want to have to run up and down the stairs to get water if i need water upstairs so i started stacking upstairs first um so don't worry okay this will be the lost family dollar footage <laughs> the rest of the family dollar haul it's mostly just juice and stuff um i like to keep stuff like that in the house so i grabbed my favorite flavors the welch's orange is 265 i grabbed two of those the apple juices were two dollars uh cran mango 275 Yep, cran pineapple also two seventy five. I grabbed two of those. Um, I grabbed some hamburger buns because I've also grabbed some chicken patties that they had in the freezer section that are really good. Throw them in the air fryer, instant fried chicken sandwich. Um, like I need any more fried anything, but anyway, that's another story. I grabbed also. Let me pull up these prices. The prices. Okay, yeah, the coffees were a dollar each and these are just some brands I've never even heard of but I was like oh that's a pretty box let's try it um so I grabbed that one I think everybody probably knows Taster's Choice and um I have tried these this before this is really good um and I grabbed a couple of boxes of the Folgers so this 24 pack was three dollars the individual packs were one dollar um, I grabbed some of the flavored water bottle enhancers because this right here is really good. It has like the fizz and everything. Um, those are a dollar. Different flavors for whoever gets thirsty. And I grabbed two boxes of the 100 count Sweet and Low. It should be easy to see this on here. Sweet. Okay, yeah. Zero calorie sweetener. Those were $2.00. Hmm, pretty good. Um, yep. So that's my rest of my family dollar haul. I will probably be posting this tonight. And this will be my last family dollar haul for a while. And then I have a Kroger haul. <laughs> Excuse me, a Kroger haul that I wanted to do for y'all. Oh, shoot. Let me go ahead and throw these Walgreens items in. Because I'm not going to do a Walgreens haul. But um, they had the three for $9.99 sodas. So I grabbed a couple of 12 packs of those and I had so many points that I got a free bag of chocolate and you don't know how much this means to me because I am legit a chocolate ho ho holic the goal will be not to open this um, and I also picked up a crock pot at Walmart for $19 isn't that cute Can you see it? oh my god I cannot wait to use it but anyway that's all for my my um Family Dollar Haul, the part two, <laughs> the Lost Files. I'm going to go ahead and put this all together for you all. Hope you enjoy it. Click like if you like it. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hope this is not shaky, but I promise these hauls are getting ready to end because, like I said, I'm not even going out of the house in November at all. All right, so stay tuned for that Kroger Haul. I, I did the pickup today. I'll lay everything out, and I'll be back. Love you guys. Bye.